Vietnam was one of the fastest growing economies in Southeast Asia, and a consequence of that is that this country has become more prone to chronic non-communicable diseases. Combine that with an ongoing shortage of medical staff, and what you get as a result is a crucial need to train doctors in the increase of chronic disease, plus the need for the right equipment to deal with it. I'm at the Vinh Uni University in Hanoi, Vietnam, where an advanced imaging education center, or AIEC, to augment the current simulation center and to provide essential radiology training courses for experienced doctors here in Hanoi. Now, Dr. Long is the director of the simulator center here, and he's waiting for me in the control room. Dr. Long, how are you, sir? Hi. Great to meet you. Yeah. Good to meet you. What is the simulation center and, and what's its purpose here at Vinh University? Well, the, the medical uh, simulation center at Vinh University is an organic part of the College of Health Sciences. We offer the trainings to uh, our university students, including a nursing student, medical student, and the resident. And also we offer a lot of training services to uh, the community for the staff from outside um, the university, including the hospital, NGOs, Clinics. Here is a screen uh, inside one of um, the training rooms. Then we can see exactly, you know, the virus I, SpO2. So we usually we don't run the scenario from here. This room is for you know monitorings and make sure that everything is okay within the sim centers. For the faculty and the technicians, when we run the scenario, we will go to the next room to the practice room of the students. This technology seems incredibly new and incredibly advanced. How advanced is it? Many uh, experts from, um, from, from uh, other, other countries, including the US, Singapore, Thailand, and many other countries when they come here. So the, the facility and the technology we have here is uh, one of the most advanced technology in uh, simulation education. In the world? Uh, at least in the regions. Well, so this is our ICU room. We set up this room for the trainings, usually we use this room for trainings for um, the, I mean the certificate from American Heart Associations. So you see that, um, hi, how are you? <laughs> so this is our mannequins. Everything here is um, similar to the setup at Vinmec Hospital. Actually, this sim center can be converted into the real hospitals. And we follow the standard of um, Vinmec why we set up this center. So the students come here just like they go to the medical ward at, at Vinmec. Now I'm off to meet Dr. Lam and where I'm meeting him is in the super lab. Now the super lab is reminiscent of what the AIEC will look like using the same software, but the AIEC will have different hardware. And here is Dr. Lam. Now, Dr. Hello, Lam, Xin Chao. Welcome to Vinh University. Thank you so much. Let's take a seat. Let's have a chat. Please, yeah. Dr. Lam, why is the AIEC so important to Vietnam's healthcare and more importantly radiology? More and more the new hospital and uh, the public sector and the private sector. So I think this center serves very well for standardize the, uh, the, 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 the skill and the competency for the for the is for the VINMAC uh, physician and the technician. But it's not only for the VINMAC but also for the, for, the, for the other hospital in Vietnam. And we think about and we plan to open that for the regional uh, medical team. So many hospitals, Vinmec, our Vinmec, and internal and regional hospital can benefit from this uh, international standard criteria so that they can improve their uh, competency um, in this field. So the idea is you get experts from around the world internationally yeah, to right. come in and train the trainers? Yes. So when we work with ZE, so there are some, some KOL from everywhere in the world will come here and help us to build the uh, faculty team, teach some the, our physicians as a technician to be the, the faculty for this program. That is very important. Brilliant. Lovely to meet you, Dr. Lab. Yeah.